Gary, can you sum up the emotion in the dressing room? Yeah, disappointed. Um, I think frustrated. Um, all of those things, I'm, I'm sure, probably sum up the, the stadium, really, because I think the fans would feel the same way. Um, you know, to get this far and, and to, to get so close, but feel now that it looks like it's so far. Um, and I think that's something we've got to learn why. Um, and I think it's something we, you know, I already understand why. Um, you know, and I think the players, like I said before, have been really honest. They've, they've worked very hard to get to this position. Um, we're just at this point of the season where you just need a little bit of, not, I don't think leadership, just a bit of responsibility to, to take hold of a game and, and show your quality in the right areas. We probably just struggle to do that at this stage of the season, haven't we, when we really want to. Um, but I thought we started, I thought we started quite bright. I thought first half we played pretty well. Uh, got in some excellent positions, scored the goal. A little bit of fortune with a goalkeeper's error, but Carl's, you know, reacted where other players don't seem to don't seem to react in those sort of positions. Um, and certainly, you know, he looked very, very bright. Um, John had a really good chance at one 0 I think, to make it two 0 And again, we just don't seem to be able to get that second goal at the right time. Had a warning sign at the other end. A um, couple of free kicks they put in our box that looked dangerous, got the heads to it, which is not like us. We've only conceded probably um, before the weekend, uh, only a couple from set pieces directly, which is a really good start. I think we're as good as anyone in the division. Worked very, very hard at it. Um, and now that's three goals we've conceded from set pieces. The first one, disappointing enough. Second one, really disappointing. You know, To get in at one all and be disappointed with that and, and not be pleased with that to then to concede after three minutes of the second half with, with you know Morrow felt as though there was a push on him but I'd say we've got to do better there individually you know we've got to take responsibility make sure your man doesn't score be aggressive be strong um, and I don't often say that about a captain but you know we, we, we should have done that better um, and then that just seemed to take the wind out of our sails at that point and we often puffed after that but couldn't really uh, I think John had another half decent chance with a shot uh, but couldn't get into enough advanced positions with enough quality really to to really trouble Brighton. You mentioned the, about the season perhaps not petering out. Was that the message that you've given to the players after the game? Yeah, I've, 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 I mean, I've almost gone in again. I mean, there's only so many times you can kind of get angry and frustrated with them. But I just said, you know, we, we, we've worked so hard to get to this position. I will not let them tail off. You know, I've just said that to them. We've got to now, you know, when you leave the ground tonight, you've got to look at yourself and say, am I doing enough? To, to, to keep the season going um, and, and I think that the way we treat players is pretty pretty fair um, you know we give them days off when we think they need it um, we, we, we make some decisions that we think are, are in their favour at times and they've got to give a little bit of that back now um, I'm not suggesting they've not been honest because I think they have but just give a little bit more um, and, that, and that's the thing when you've went like I said when you've worked so hard to get to this point you don't want to give it away now. Um, and whether that means not finishing in the playoffs, you know, can we finish seventh? Can we finish eighth? You know, I don't care what their target is, but can we try and still achieve something? Um, if people say that achieving, finishing outside the playoffs is not achieving anything, then so be it. But um, you know, we've got to try and win as many games of football as we, we can. And we did at the start of the season. We're struggling a little bit at the back end. And obviously Saturday, Reading away. Chance to put things right, perhaps. Just looking at something different, maybe. Well, the chance to put things right, but we need to be better. Um, certainly away from home, you know, we've 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 been poor results-wise away from home. Um, but recently, we keep going to goal up, and, and and before you'd say that would be almost the end of the game for us because we're so good at it. We now seem to be struggling to to close the game out and and, and doing that with as much professionalism as as we did at the start of the season. And and, and you can argue if you're only going to win a game by scoring one goal, then maybe you can't keep hanging on all season you know but that's been something we've done well because we haven't scored enough goals defensively our records not bad you know our records pretty much up there with with the top six defensively attacking wise you know we've, we've nowhere near scored enough goals so uh, something we'll have to address and, and whether we do something different sadly I don't always again doing something different doesn't always guarantee you're gonna you know sometimes you get further away from the truth but um, you know we'll have, we'll have a go at trying to see if we win the game simple as that